Something that we talked about uh, this week was having some more urgency uh, coming off that short um, bad loss that we had last week. Um, you know, we didn't like the way we performed. Uh, a lot of people re overreacted to it because it was prime time game, divisional game. Um, but the good thing is we got a lot of football to be played. Um, and like I said, it was great to come out here and dominate um, you know, the whole the whole entire game, I think, um, and leading into the bye weekend. So, yeah. Zach, Zach said he expected a performance like this. So what, what kind of set the tone for that? What made you guys so confident you could bounce back in emphatic fashion? Yeah, uh, we knew. Like I said, uh, we had a short week. We didn't practice on Wednesday. Um, Zach does a really good job of keeping us healthy, you know, being able to communicate with players and stuff like that. So um, I just think we guys came in with a fresh mind, um, knowing that we were going into a bye week as well. Um, and know that these games are going to continue to get more important, more important um, over the next couple of weeks. So. When Joe's having a day like that, Jesse, what does it do for everybody else's energy level and mood? Yeah. Um, you know, it's different when Joe Burrow's having a day um, like that, but when Mixon is running the ball, um, it kind of creates the dominance of our team um, on all three phases. So um, Joe is definitely running with a different type of uh, pop. And uh, like I said, it got going, uh, not just through the offense, but through our defense and uh, special teams as well. 35 nothing at the half. That's about as dominant a performance as I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. Have you been in part of anything like that? Um, no, I've been on the other side of it. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, yeah, you know, it's good uh, to see our offense have some confidence. Um, you know, I know, I know how much they take pride in, in their work. Um, from the offensive line, from Joe Burrow to the receivers to the running backs, um, to see them do what they did today. Um, and in our defense, I don't think they crossed the 50 um, until the second half. So um, that, just like I said, we got to continue to play um, complimentary football the second half of the season. And uh, a lot of these games will be here. Um, and our fans were great today. Um, so it's good when we start fast, the, the fans start starting fast a little bit. So, yeah, it's it a great win for us. How were the young DBs that were pressed into service? Yeah, I thought they did a really good job. Um, I mean, I think Cam uh, would have been playing a little bit more if he wasn't hurt at the beginning of the year. So I'm not surprised with him. Um, and then, you know, Eli has been playing with us all year last year. So um, and then you got J.D., who, I mean, I think he's a baller. I call him every day because every day he makes a play. So um, it's no surprise, man. We got a, we got a close group in there. Um, we're very open. Um, me and Vaughn do a good job of communicating um, and letting people know when we are when we are in tough positions and stuff like that. So um, it just goes whole whole hand um, from top to the bottom. I'm proud of those guys. It seemed like you guys played uh, like just as physical as the offense. They came in with a pretty good running game. You guys seem to match the physicality. Yeah, um, I think we did a really good job on first down. Um, we got them in second and long, uh, forcing the – you know, the backup quarterback to, you know, make some tight throws um, in the first half, and then they had to go to Baker in the second. Um, so, yeah, I just think that it was a whole dominance performance as a team. What is that last throw was to you? Uh, I think Walker's last throw was to you. Like, yeah. That um, yeah, we were in cover two. Um, I seen him, I think, the first drive he was trying to throw it. Uh, me and Cam kind of talked about it. I told him to stay low and I'll, I'll stay high, and he overthrew it a little bit, and I got me one. So it's always, it's always good getting one. Yeah, um, it's something that we do every Friday as a defense. Um, in the indoor, we, we catch an interception and we come up with some type of celebration. I don't know what Jermaine's doing with the, uh, the snow angels or whatever it was. Uh, I decided to pull out the uh, Remember the Titans. So it was good, man. It's, it just shows how connected we are. Like I said, our celebrations are getting really good. Um, hopefully we can continue that. Yeah, so so Jermaine, I, I thought he was gonna pull it out, and I was like, hey, if we catch another pick, we're doing to remember the Titans. So I mean, we we're very uh, whatever you want to call it, choreography, whatever you call it. Uh, we did a really good job, I think. <laughs> yeah, um, it just we, okay. Um, we um, like I said, we we talked about coming in here, playing fast. Um, and just knowing how important these games are going to get in the second half of the season. Um, going into it at 5-4 and four with a winning record, um, damn sure looks better than 4-5 and five, um, going into a bye. So, um, like I said, we're going to have a lot of big games here, um, here in this stadium. So, uh, hopefully the fans can come out and you know, show how they showed today.